What's on guys? Uh, I forgot how it was. I'm going back to the reviews. So if you read the title of this video. Yeah. Like, one of the biggest jokes when it comes to like, harem, or the romance genre, where the childhood friend always loses. But he's my, like pretty much my reasons of why I'm on team childhood friend. And pretty much talk about every anime that I've seen where the childhood friend at least has like a fair chance, or obviously be on their side. And, yeah. Cause, trust me, I've been friends on before, many times, and I just want the anime girl to finally come out of the friend zone. So, the origins of why I'm on team childhood friend it's because of this anime girl, Sayori, from Doki Doki Literature Club. And if you played the game yourself, I've seen that gameplay. Yeah, that game is definitely unsettling. Like, I actually played the game 10 hours. You know, I played it like a, like a second time to get the, the true ending. And yeah, so pretty much Doki Doki is the reason why my team child Frank is Sayori. Like, that game, like, it's just like, not suited for everyone for like certain themes, and it definitely gets to you. And Sayori, and pretty much, like I wrote all my poems for Sayori. That's how much I <laughs> I loved her, and yeah, so she's the reason why I saw being on childhood friends. And the game I believe came out in twenty seventeen, so yeah, that's how it all started. So 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 Nezakoi, definitely an anime about childhood friends, where. Ichijo's pretty much, but almost all of his love ventures, childhood friends, like Orodari, Chitoga, Ma Marika, like all of them, like it's just like my god, like as a kid making all the promises, like I'm, I'm like that really <laughs> so much frustrated me. I I seen like the manga ending, and. Pretty much is like the only case where, like, well, one of the few cases where I'm not a team childhood friend. My opinion, Ichijo should have been with Sugumi because she was the other one that didn't have a key, so it's like, clean slate, everybody. And now the other girls were like, not certain if they truly love him or not, and about Sugumi, way ahead of them. Like, even so, like, a kiss somewhat. And yeah. Let's see, another one? Okay, a hundred. Where this kind of like pretty much like at least some two childhood friends for Hiyoto. There's Emilio, and if I remember correctly, y'all, uh, it, it was Sakura. So yeah, it's, it's just whenever it come, when there's like more than one childhood friend, it's just like, well, dang. Like it's just like, who would I choose? Like, who seems to be the better option? But I choose Emilio because very strap. Yeah. When it comes to anime, I definitely love them tomboys and reverse straps. <laughs> so, yeah. Not by uh, all over here. <laughs> yeah, okay. <laughs> Moving on. <laughs> See another one? Okay, I can't, I, it's really hot, difficult. Okay, it's called. Also, Magi rom com where the childhood friend won't lose. Same here. There's more than one childhood friend. There's like three of them. It, it, it's just crazy. It's just, in my honest opinion, the best one is like, like Shiro. That's a that, that's her short name because Kuroha and Maria. Like my God, Kuroha. Like Kuroha could have. One, but she just had to get like her revenge for getting rejected, and she had to reject him back. But I'm with Shiro, cause yeah, it's just like Kuro, God, that just can't make like herself look really bad for the majority of the series, and yeah, so Shiro for 
the win. Okay, bring him down the darkness. Like, okay, currently I'm saying like most of the like it's like 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 I said between like auntie team childhood friend and t and not team childhood friend. But here in the darkness, Ryoto, his childhood friend Koroha, like when she uses her magic powers, I'm Nisha all the time, so that kind of slightly frustrates me, and which is why I'm more on team Kazumi. Because she just seems like a better option, and I, I personally prefer her more. That's the thing about harem anime. Just choose the girl you, that, you, that you think is best girl, and so protect yourself into like the main protagonist. But it's just like that. Really, like unusual stuff is like it just kind of like I feel bad, but it's just it kind of gets to my nerve just a bit. Sorry, Kara. Huh? All right, let's see. What else? Okay, so the only anime that thing where the childhood friend wins it's like a, a 90s anime called DNA Square where Junta like I only seen the anime where Junta and Ami finally end up, to get, finally end up together and that's because uh, Karin the girl from the future you know, completed her mission like she did catch some feelings for Junta and Junta definitely obviously had like a thing for her but luckily, she gave him amnesia, if I remember correctly. Yeah, there was also an OVA. But yeah, so hopefully, Junta's still with Ami. Because that, that, that's like another reason. Besides the area where, like, alright, the childhood friend actually, like, won at the end. Do you another one? Okay. Um, high school DD, like I said, it's like like back and forth between like team travel friend, yes, but high school DD, like even now, and Ace, like when she first in season two when she first got introduced, I'm like, mm, okay, yeah, she's never gonna join the harem, but now, I say no, cause like Ace, like I said before, like twice, <laughs> with like my why I hate why I don't like the hair drama anymore and. I love hate relationship high school lady. Yeah, you can watch one of those videos and yeah, I've said enough about high school lady. Just like don't want to sound like a broken record at this point. <laughs> but yeah, just her reason is for like in you see, I'm 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 sadly disappointed with her or even not. Okay, I think one more. Okay, so this is like the only anime I haven't seen. Girlfriend, girlfriend, where the main protagonist, his girlfriend is his childhood friend. And I just think she could do a lot better because he's like, okay, now a girl confesses me. Oh, what do I do now? And, and the thing is, it's like, if I remember correctly, it's the same author who, who did Ah Ahu, Ahu Girl. And Ahu Girl, I like. like. Both of them are supposed to be like over the top comedy. And I believe, if I remember correctly, like, Girlfriend Girlfriend is supposed to be, like, like, a destruction of, like, the construction of, like, the hair and drum. And I just think, like, it just goes way too over the top for me. Eh, <clears throat> yeah. But because of High School DD, makes me want to kind of watch Girlfriend Girlfriend or even School Days, because I feel like, you know, might be better compared to what went down with High School DD. So, yeah, that's about it. Well, there's also infinite stratos, like with Hoki and Ichika. But definitely, Hoki got the win, because in, in the season one finale, she, like, that main ball, I mean, Pajani was straight gonna kiss her. That's definitely, like, great confirma confirmation that he likes that, you know, girl. So, anyway, thanks for watching, guys, who liked it. New Dragon Plays, whenever. And. Yeah. Team childhood friend, everybody. Bye!